Copyright is tough to deal with on YouTube, so my way of avoiding that is this. The anime won't be showed in my video, but there's a link at the top of the description where you can watch my reaction and the anime at the same time. Is it jank? Yes. But does it do the job? Yes. So you can't complain. There will also be a timer going in my video that shows you exactly what part of the anime I'm reacting to. If for some reason you can't watch the YouTube Double website, a link to the actual episode will also be in the description so you can open that in a separate window with me. The great thing about the Double Video website is that it also works on mobile, so you guys have a chip into this too. Sorry to make you jump through rings of fire to be able to do this, but gotta be able to protect yourself on YouTube. Anyways, enjoy the reaction. What's going on guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here and today we are finally back with the reaction segment. This is something I've been planning very strategically for quite a while because there's a lot of stuff to avoid with copyright and I wanted to make sure that if I'm doing this segment I'm doing so in the safest fashion possible so right now we are going to be watching the anime now if you're watching this on YouTube you're gonna notice that this whole fucking section is going to be blacked out boxed out censored whatever the hell you may want to call it that is because we need to avoid them strikes my boy I was foolish with my other channel and there was a lot of precautions that I took with my anime reactions before but I didn't take them for one video and I got caught on it so Safety first, man. Wrap it up. We're gonna do just that. I, I have no clue, man. I mean, I don't know how many of you would be interested in watching this shit with me. We got 852 viewers in here. That's fucking crazy. So, really surprising stuff there. I'm glad that, you know, you niggas are curious about this show the same way I am. I cannot wait to get into this, man. Now, in terms of where I found the episode to watch, uh, a lot of places that, you know, are you know, mainstream, like Crunchyroll, they didn't have the episode, but um, this place, Anime Tofu, whatever it may be, this website probably ain't gonna last too long, but I mean, hey, whatever. As long as we can watch this thing, I'm fine with that, and in good quality as well, this place seems to have it for us, so we're going to be obviously watching Japanese voices, English subs, hopefully you don't have a problem with that. Let's get into it, man. I'm fucking hype. Are you guys excited? Because I fucking am. Let's do it, man. I want to make sure my audacity recording is good, too. And we're solid. Let's do this, man. We're going to make this full screen, and let's go. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. Reaction videos, man. I, I don't know what the fuck this is about, but I'm guessing it's a fighting anime due to certain things that I've seen of it. So, whatever. Let's do it. One Punch Man. What the hell could this potentially be about? Some bald dude that looks like Gamer right now. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Let me know if I should turn the volume up at some point. Maybe I should turn it up now. What the fuck? Motherfucking Piccolo came through! God damn, nigga! What's the deal? Yo! Yo, yo, what the fuck's going on? All right, this shit is real. I didn't know it was like this. The artwork looks so, like... Smile, man. What the fuck? This is so serious. I thought it was a joke anime, like... I didn't know this shit was real. Turn up the volume? I got you. I didn't know the shit was real like that. Smile, man. Nigga. Whenever, whenever I see the protagonist in like the pictures on Twitter, he lo it looks like it's from a joke. Like, I didn't know Piccolo fucks niggas up. So he's an established superhero, I guess. The artwork is crazy, too. Like, the quality is really high. Oh man, that's a fucked up scene. Oh damn it! Damn, what the fuck? So I'm guessing he saved her. Of course, is that the one punch man? No, the one punch man. No, let's go. This nigga looks so stupid. <laughs> The animation is sick, though. Vaccine, man. Typical.
Very cliche storyline. Well, at least enemy. He's on his Orochi shit, man. That er Okay. That's literally what he's all about. So I'm guessing he can defeat his opponents with one punch. This is a joke? Whoever the hell that bad guy was, he reminds me super hard of Orochi from uh, from um, King of Fighters, the early the earlier generation. So, is this a serious anime or not? Like, I'm confused now because it looked extremely real from the beginning sequence. Like, everything was super high high intensity, and the artwork was dramatic, and things didn't seem like they would be like lighthearted, but. This guy comes onto the scene, he defeats the dude with one fucking punch, and next thing you know, everything just goes super fun. Like, what the hell's going on, man? I wanna, I wanna take in the intro theme. What the hell... So whatever he punches, it just totally obliterates it, clearly, from what the intro sequence is trying to show us. The Gims is here? <laughs> you niggas are fucking stupid. My boy Gimmer? My boy Caillou? Is that him? Go, 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 go. What the fuck is this, yo? This shit is gonna... So he's pissed off. Oh shit! You can see that shit in his eyes too. Crabalante. Oh, he's fucked up, niggas. Oh, he. Oh, he's fucked up, niggas. Oh shit. What? That's kind of real. This is fucked up. This nigga, nigga said he's gonna give you crabs. Good one. Did you think of that? Did you, did you think of that right away? What the hell, dude? What the fuck is going on? Is this serious or not? Eddie. <laughs> what the hell is this? Why the hell would you do that? No, not really. This nigga. I, I, I gotta say, I feel bad for that little nigga. Alright, what the fuck? So I'm guessing this dude with the hair is the one punch man. But well, for some reason, he has hair back in here, but he cuts it off, I guess. Sakura Bolo. That shit's done.
What the hell? I mean, they actually fit, but... <laughs> Yo. Yo. That's enough to that's enough to kill yourself in Japan. You you got no job, nigga. That's it. Fuck it. <laughs> you can't live here anymore. That's it. You just signed your fucking death wish. Is that it? You see that reference, yo? This shit is this is a real ass anime, yo. What the fuck? Yo, this shit is crazy. Ah, God! What the fuck? Alright, this is a little weird. This shit is kind of weird, bro. What the fuck? I trained so hard I went bald. Damn. Rest in peace. This nigga wears the same fucking... I, I don't know whether to take this anime seriously or not anymore. Like, it seems like it tries to create some serious undertones, but it just fucking slaps you with, with, with satire afterwards. Like, you can tell this is somewhat of a parody anime, where it's making fun of typical scenes. Yo! Them feet! <laughs> Them feet! <laughs> That's probably what happened to Gimmer. That Shingeki no Kyojin right there? Yo, that's the Colossal, my boy. The animation is really good. I, I admit that. Yeah, that's... Biceps King. Call Levy. <laughs> we need that nigga. Oh, that's nice of him. Isn't didn't Aaron's dad give him a shot of something too? So it would make sense if his dad was like working with this dude to create that serum or something. This is probably what happens in Attack on Titan, man. They take a little shot of something. In fact, maybe this might just be parodying Attack on Titan itself. Is this a direct parody of it? Oh, wow. So he's dead ass naked? In fact, maybe they censored that in. Oh, actually, no, no, he's. Nigga! Nigga! Damn! Yo, this shit is crazy! Yeah. Nigga, damn. Someone said it's a parody of Boku no Pico. Please, don't fuck with me. CTB. Nigga, this is crazy. Nigga, this is crazy.
Wow, nigga. Are you seeding me? What the fuck? Yeah, I guess he wasn't aware of which shoulder. This nigga couldn't look over. Oh, shit. Ah. What the fuck, dude? This shit is fucking crazy. Someone said, we tech those? Yo, word, nigga. Damn, nigga. Mom spaghetti right there. That Forsetti? Yo. Yo. Nigga, damn. Nigga, damn. Alright, so... I don't see how there can be an opponent for this guy. Kind of reminds you of uh, it really puts me in mind of Parasite, Shinji. Like, remember when he was like fusing more with Migi and he started to feel less and less emotion? It's kind of crazy. All these enemies are ridiculous. It reminds me of Ultimate Muscle. What the hell? This nigga's going off and he's not even paying attention. This nigga's not even paying attention. Damn! What the fuck? Yeah, I can imagine why. You fucking beat everybody with one punch. Well, I get a punch out of it. Hey, please don't hurt me. Oh, shit. So somebody came specifically for his ass. Okay. So someone's actually pursuing him this time around. Damn. Yo! It's serious now. Nigga. The true earthlings. What the hell? There's a lot of them too. So they came to sit. Damn! When did this happen? 
Oh my fucking god. When did this shit happen? You can tell his heart is fucking lit right now. We are the real earthlings. That's crazy. Oh, okay. All right. There we go. Woo! Let's go! This nigga's real! This nigga's real! This... Yo! This shit is real! Fucking eyes, yo. This shit is so. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Nigga, 70% of the world's population was wiped out within a night. Damn. I wonder if his kicks have the same properties. The music. They're speaking like he's dead. Obviously, he's not. So, look, there's different sizes of them. Woo! So, there's different sizes. Like, there's giants and there's little ones. Damn! Oh my fucking god. Yo. Is this even really happening? What the hell? Did he just wipe out all of them? Did he? Nigga! We at the boss fight and we are in episode one right now. My boy. Are you fucking kidding me? No fucking way. Are you kidding me? None of that shit happened. Wow. Wow, nigga. Oh my. I can't fucking do it with this anime. I can't fucking do it, dude. Are you really being serious with me? That fucking show, dude. Okay. <laughs> All right. Hold on. Kind of funky. I like it. It's bouncy. It's funky. It's funky. I'm going to say my opinions for after I hear the full outro and whatever. What the hell, dude?
What the hell is going on? How many viewers do we have? I have to check through this. How many of you guys are into this shit? 1,190 of you. Hilarious. It's funny that you don't actually see the guy at all in the outro. This is random cap. Who the hell is that? Alright, so, One Punch Man, Episode 1, a lot of you have seen this already, but I'm going to give my initial thoughts on this right now. I really don't know how to feel with this anime. Um, I do like it, I'll, I'll put that out the way right now, I do enjoy it, I had a great time with that first episode. Um, as you can see, with the first episode I was quiet for most of the time, I just wanted to take in exactly what the anime was trying to portray, and right now I don't understand what the fuck that is. It comes across super serious at times, but then it just totally parodies itself the next minute. It's, it's crazy, because there's a whole influx of emotion. Like, when those ground dwellers came through, shit seemed like it was real. And I thought that the whole plot of the anime was going to be him trying to defeat all of these guys. And then suddenly it seemed like things were happening too fast. He was going against these massive versions of them. And then afterwards, he fights the fucking boss. As, as things progressed really quickly with that, I sort of tried to feel like, okay, is this really happening? You heard me say that during that fight, right? I said, is this really happening? Like, I don't understand if this is a dream or if this is like, I, I couldn't get it. But sure enough, it was a dream. He woke up and the anime just totally shits on itself in a funny way. But I don't know. I usually like my anime with an actual sense of urgency, dread, fear, anxiety, stress. I like anime that actually do make you feel that. And it seems like it does so for certain scenes, but at the same time, it doesn't because it just totally laughs at itself. And I, I, I think it's cool. It's a genius anime in that regard. Like, it parodies itself. It basically satires itself. And I've said that so many times over, but I, I like it. And the fact that the artwork is so good, too, and I gotta give props to the art. An extremely amazing presentation in terms of um, their serious scenes where things get really drastic and you see his face turn super realistic. It's, it's crazy. The artwork is definitely a plus, and it helps to portray the emotions of this anime. Something like this probably wouldn't be possible if we were talking like 10 years ago, due to the extremity of how big the artwork is a focus on, because, you know, the artwork wasn't as good 10 years ago, except for some really high production anime. But this one is awesome. This, 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 is, uh, this is amazing. Visuals are awesome. But, I mean, I don't know, man. How many episodes of this anime are currently out right now? Is this an ongoing anime? And if they are ongoing, then when does the next episode come out? How many episodes are we up to right now? Guys, let me know. Um, we're going to watch episode two of this whole thing. Like, I'm so curious to see where this goes from now. 